Brandon in Glendale, I assume California, eh, writes to me, Dear Paul, when doing modifications, I have observed that when you change the amount of distortion in a stereo system, it can change the apparent but not the actual frequency balance. As an example, upgrading some capacitors to high quality but with some value may give this result. Have you observed this and can you comment? Well, yeah, I think so. I think I know what you mean. So here's kind of what I have observed. And I'm not sure I'm going to blame it entirely on distortion, but let's just use that as our, uh, as our basis for talking about this. In many cases, when we listen to a less than great amplification device, for whatever reason, because it needs different capacitors or it has distortion or it has you know, something that is less than optimal, oftentimes that manifests itself in the listening room as grunge or brightness or a objectionable harshness, okay? And when we hear that, it, you kind of tend to turn the volume down a little bit. It's, it's bright it is the best way to say it. It's kind of, it's offensive. So we turn it down a little bit. We certainly don't turn the volume up, right? We don't do that. So that's a kind of frequency aberration that unfortunately you don't measure it as such. So if I run a frequency sweep on an amplifier that is making that kind of brash, harsh presentation to the listener, the frequency response is flat as a board. Yet I hear what sounds like exaggerated high frequencies. That's that grunge that I'm talking about, that distortion or that brightness. And when we change the capacitors, when we rejigger the circuit and we get rid of that, all of a sudden it sounds like the amplifier is not as bright. While in fact, the frequency response is identical. And I think that's what you're talking about. That would be my guess. And yes, that is valid. I've heard it. I hear it all the time. And it can be fixed. And it has nothing to do with changing the frequency response. So hope that helps. All right. Thanks for the question. I'll talk to you later. Bye.